alive and active in the situation and not from what's being reported because what's being reported is a lot. And for all of those that are going around sharing that FEMA's paying for rooms, when you call that number, it's a porn site. When you call that number, it's a technical, uh, uh, technical, uh, uh, you know, where they help you fix technical issues. So that is a lie. FEMA ain't doing anything. Where is Joe Biden? Where is the president of the United States? And no, this ain't about politics, but you the president. You haven't even addressed it. Where is Kamala Harris? None of them have addressed that people are out here in Texas dying. This is an attack. Nothing really new, but it's picking up steam and it's building momentum in certain circles. The worst part is you may not even be aware of it, but groundwork is being laid. What are the main reasons for these same old tired ideas being revitalized is because those pushing globalism and government control on a global level have mastered the art of hiding it in plain sight and then just dismissing it as a joke. A great example would be this. The United Nations Earth Summit, Agenda 21. Yeah, that kind of sounds like Fahrenheit 451. I don't think that ended well. Agenda 21. They refer to it as sustainable development. Well, that sounds good. Gee, Wally, that sure sounds great to me. I mean, who's against development, especially the sustainable kind? Yeah. yeah, you might change your mind when you hear a little bit of the background of sustainable development. There is nothing else other than this but an attack. And you know what? I'm going to go ahead and end the live, and I'm going to start another one so I can show y'all live and direct from here in Dallas. Not what you're hearing on the news because they lied. They said that they have a right to control who gets power and who doesn't. Who's critical? That's what they say. We're determining who's critical and who's not. We have not had power in five days. I have two twin girls, 15-month-old, that cannot be in shelters and in homes around everybody else because she was injured at the hospital. So she just got off of heart medication. The devil is a liar. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying is, without a fight, we better come together and we better stick together. And we better raise up and we better sound the alarm. Why? Because they are trying to kill us. And for all of those that are looking from the outside, what's going on in Texas, be soon because they're coming near to you. In California, they're already talking about rolling blackouts. In different parts of the state, they're already talking about rolling blackouts, okay? So I'm telling you right now, Pizza Hut don't even have enough. I went to Pizza Hut yesterday, ordered 30 pizzas so we could feed the people in the hotel rooms. The hotels are price gouging. I went outside and talked to a person that was leaving. I said, did your power come back on? They said, no, but we can't stay here. We paid $1,000 in five days Dang. for a room that allowed people to come out and let their dogs poop and urinate. It's unsafe. And the warming centers, let me say this in closing, the warming centers that they're telling everybody that they can go to, the warming centers are asking you, have you been vaccinated? Oh, and one more thing, don't let me forget this. For people who don't know what Agenda 21 is, it's basically, it's not what is Agenda 21, it's almost what isn't. And you're going to look long and hard to find anything now that isn't Agenda 21. It is the blueprint it is the action plan to inventory and control all land, all water, all plants, all minerals, all construction, all animals, all means of production, all energy. A comprehensive plan of action to be taken globally, nationally, and locally by organizations of the United Nations system, governments, and major groups in every area in which humans impact the environment all animals all means of production all energy all information and all human beings in the world it is a completely comprehensive plan it's global and it's implemented locally and that is where you're going to see it in your town right there in your town it is in every single town all across the united states and the world right now wow that's kind of broad. Now, it has been adopted by more than 178 governments. I believe there's only 191 on the planet. The United Nations had their big conference on the environment and development in Rio back in 1992, and that's when everybody jumped on board. But it sounds harmless. It's only Agenda 21. Yeah, yeah, go look this one up.
We've been made to stand in lines, even in freezing temperature when your skin is falling off, when you are developing hypothermia uh, uh, within five to ten minutes, okay? We are made to stand outside because we can't go inside the stores all in, collectively because of COVID, but we can all gather together in the warming uh, centers. We can gather together. We can do that there. We can gather together in the hotel rooms. That's not a problem. But you know why you can't gather in, inside of Walmart and you can't you gotta stand in those long lines? Because even in the midst of all of this, they still got CDC officials uh, fining the people if they are over capacity. They still want the six feet rule in place. They still want to, I said a pandemic, they trying to kill us out here. If you want to see the information, because I want y'all to share this, you know, I know everybody got a microwave mentality. They want you to say what they want you to say in five minutes or less. Mm -hmm. So here go your five minutes. Share that. Share that. Tell them Dr. Tawana Worlds is in Texas, live on the ground, been delivering food and blankets and everything else. We ain't got no generators. People that have been using gas generators, guess what? They don't have no gas. So that means more people will freeze. And, and, and the National Guard is supposed to be coming through to do welfare checks. Do you know how much, how high the death rate will go up once they do the welfare checks? Now, if I show y'all these next videos and these next pictures that I'm getting ready to show y'all, and you see that the way stuff is frozen in their house, if you don't believe that people is dead, I see there's no. something wrong with you. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you right now. I'm asking you right now. I'm asking you right now. This is bigger than 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 black or white or red and blue or politics and Dems and lefts. This is bigger than that. This is bigger than that. And I have been sounding the alarm and warning the people for quite some time, but now it's here upon us. Too late for shoulda, coulda, woulda. Now it's time for us to do something for one another. It's time for us to come together. Build our own stuff. We ain't got no food. They put a red flag yesterday and said after... All the snow melt, then they'll assess the damage. We ain't got no food, y'all. There ain't no water. There ain't no clean water. They say boil the water, but how can you boil the water with no power? Mm. How can you boil the water if you're using gas uh, 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 appliances to, to stay warm? How could you boil mm. the water? Yeah. They trying to kill us, y'all. I'm telling y'all, share it with everybody. Where's Beyonce? Where's... Where's all these people? Where's all these uh, 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 Black Lives Matter? Where are they at? Tag them. Please do something. Tag Joe Biden. Tag all of them. Tag Camilla. Tag everybody. Tag all of these officials that got us divided against one another while they in their warm houses and people are dying. Yes. This was a pandemic. This was planned. And the reason why we without power is not because the storm put the power out. The reason why we are without power is because they choose and pick and choose who gonna get power so that they can save their grid. Ain't that something? So you would rather die to save your grid. Well, it could be worse. If the whole grid go out, it could be worse. Everybody could be in dark. But you know what? Let's take that chance because it's gonna get a whole lot worse that you guys kill people on your watches. Since someone, they still got power. If you go to Highland Park and drive right out of Highland Park, it gets dark again. <laughs> Come on, man. FEMA can't oh, man. Can't get, like I said, don't get it twisted, Paul. So nice, so. Don't get it twisted now. Before we go assuming that the electric order, company out there Michael just Chip. gave them power, they might have solar generators, and some of the people got solar on their houses. And a lot of people got a couple of generators back up. They got a backup generator. Not just one or two or three if they got the money. And you can't hear them so much. But you know if they got a generator, it's going to be... Bah. So they're quiet. So they either got solar on top of the house or solar, uh, like a handheld solar like we have. Um, they got some type of solar or they got a lot of damn lithium batteries in their house to, to power up. Either way, they knew it was coming. They was ready. The main, the people complain they can't eat. This is the main criteria that I told you. They can't eat, they cold, and now they're mad. They're calling the electric company getting mad. I can't feed my newborn. And it, that's what we just did not that. I, I could have sworn we just talked about that a couple of weeks ago. I can't feed my newborn. My babies can't eat. We got no running water. That's this is this right here, some bullshit. All the stores are closed. What are we supposed to do? <laughs> when I told you, motherfuckers laugh at us. They come on our site and talk shit and all that mm -hmm. shit. Now that shit hitting the fan, niggas sitting back going, damn. You see? And it's not over. What Texas 
X experiencing is going to be a 50 state experience. It's just, they're just testing, man.